dedicated to you. You are the most memorable person on the face of the earth. We love you and we miss you and we can't wait to see you back here very soon. Welcome to the human experience. Yeah. I expect to be the first one up on my first time. Anyways, a brief history on what I wrote tonight is called You're Not Welcome Here. It is a message to my former self. I used to be a very angry, miserable individual. There's no room for you. I'm trying to change. My thoughts and impulses must be rearranged. Let me cut through confusion by saying this clear. You're just an intrusion and you're not welcome here. I met the person that I once used to be. Bitter and angry, a nuisance to see. Your misery delivered a blueprint to me. Live better, be better, think differently. How deep when do you we bury truth? truth? Dressed in suits and trends, running in angular races, masquerading with masks and gemstones of acceptance. Shine for impression. Enough to stand out, just to fit in. Have you eaten peaches Force and forgotten in. eyelashes? In the places we never count, the tired glare and the red ribbon hunger, the wax filling hard won laugh lines in lambskin palms. She is a contradiction, everything that is the light in the dark and my turn from dawn to dusk. She feeds the corn to the crows, close enough to feel her winter chill. All the old people are dying and not waking up less of breath and change. Inherently incapable of learning anything more than what they already know. All the old people are dying, thank God. It's about time to progress to our new consciousness. Do I offend? Don't mean to, but it is what it is. Let's turn society against itself here and have unreal expectations of ugly. Anybody that doesn't match that unreal expectation isn't ugly. As always, I decide I'm going to lead the example here. If you are 300 pounds, have one leg... Dreaming. Oh hell! At the top of my lungs, I let the fly the boomerang of madness into a crowd of people nearby. Mounting their skyscraper prejudices, I waved my hand about in the heavens and moved the stars around. It was a baseball game for suicide prevention. And at first I'm like, yeah, that's cool, but then I thought about it. And I don't want to be like a dick or anything. But I just don't think that this has ever happened. There's never been like a point where a guy's like, You'll hear wailing all day long. Miles and miles through the wind. If I'm a rotten tree that can only bear rotten fruit And then if you listen to me, does that make you a sinner too? When Jesus was a dead Nobody can take my religion from me. Therefore, nobody can refuse me to the right to practice it. It is something within me. If there is no alternative to persecution, and if that is the only way that Christ wants to come among going through their boring lives and she saw me and I saw her it's like we recognized each other we're like oh yeah we're gonna, she's like oh we're gonna have some fun oh look at you you look like you got some sugar in your tank driver who stayed a mile or two under the speed limit and he liked to leave a little earlier than other people would but he never missed a turn or had to ask for directions and he always got the group to the meeting on time sometimes Does that mean you have to talk to a midget? <laughs> or, or I meant to him that I fell in love with my best friend's girlfriend. But either way, either way would have been better than him finding out in details than reading it out of her diary. Diary of a nympho is how I lost my best friend. Look into my eyes. Move me into the windows of your soul. 
Never leave me, my dear, no matter what volitions, volitions remain. You will always I be alone. I a nightmare on a sleepless night to write this poem to you as an apology for that fight we had while making love. I don't think you ever had so, so much fun. Every time fun I go outside, you'd be like, whoa, what's up, BB? I was like, what's up, dog? BB in the house, right? Even though I'm outside. Like, I have a girlfriend now, and she's white as hell. She don't know what it means. So, like, I don't know what another. it means. Divide our feelings and our facts and our inability to look past red or blue, the left or the right, me versus you. Must we always be divided and always be so one-sided? But why are we so quick to hate one another when the men in Texas with the conservative views are made the same way with the same so heart and skin? last week I talked about is there's no God that's going to come in and save us and, and help us get to levels of success that we want. It all depends on us and our daily actions and our habits. Silence comes so before creation and the heavens were spread without a word. Christ was born in the dead of night and though there has been no power like his, he did not strive. I'm going to let myself be lifted by and by. I will lay my trouble down by the water where the river will never run dry. There's a lot of things that came about it. I was scarring my stomach, as you can see. I drank it. I, I, I was drinking and driving. So if you laugh at these jokes and then get in the car and drive home, then you're too drunk to drive. All right. So don't drink and drive. That's the only message I have for you guys. And there's no punchline behind it. Nothing. Don't drink and drive. It's not worth it. Save your life. Save someone else's life. And uh, you know, keep your family from having that heartache. Hi, but Big anyway. D. We can't wait to see you again. This video is just for you. We love you so much, and we miss you. We hope that you get better. And and we're all rooting for you. What an amazing event we just had over here at The Beat on Fremont and 6th. DJ Miss Joy just invited me out. She's like, come on now to see what the human experience is all about. And we just got finished. And I, all I can say it was absolutely amazing. What a great place to be able to bring a lot of friends, meet a lot of new friends, network, and honestly be able to see so much passion and so much talent that Las Vegas downtown has to offer. If you've never been to it, Go to Facebook right now, facebook.com slash human experience Las Vegas so you can see all the scheduled events that they have. They have all these different poetry, singers, uh, people. Uh, it's absolutely amazing. Just do yourself a favor and see it. And I have to show this one because I was blown away by them. Siren Strings was absolutely amazing. Uh, find their Facebook too, Siren Strings. They were the quartet with the four girls and I, I'm gonna assume it's the lead singer. She had so much freaking passion and she was just awesome. I absolutely loved it. So if you've never seen them, do that. Uh, follow uh, DJ Miss Cho uh, Joy also so you can see all the different events. Uh, Cosmopolitan uh, Boulevard Pool, she's the DJ there. She DJs at Mix so you can see all her stuff that way. Follow her on Facebook and Twitter uh, and it's just an awesome event. If it's the first time you're seeing any of our episodes, do the normal stuff. Uh, give us a like, give us a thumbs up if you like the video and then subscribe and then let us know what was your favorite uh, person out of all the things that we just showcased what was your favorite one and until that next episode we'll talk to everybody soon hi Vicky I didn't forget your favorite song
doesn't come with ruby red slippers to take you back where you came from. And try as I might, click in my heels. There's no place, no place. I just can't get home.